In a world where only 2,640 people are billionaires, you'd think that it takes a lifetime to acquire a billion dollars. However, there are a lot of young folks that are rolling in billions. In this video, we're going to take a look at a group of young game changers who've not only cracked the billionaire code, but have done it before many people even finish college. Let's start with the 30-year-old Czech billionaire, Michal Strand. This guy runs a company called Czechoslovak Group, which makes cool stuff like army trucks, radar systems, and even ammunition. Now, Mikkel didn't just stumble upon this gold mine. He actually got it from his dad, who started it back in 1995, and now he has a mind-blowing net worth of $2.1 billion. Mikkel isn't just about business, though. He's got not one, but two super cool Black Hawk helicopters. These aren't just for show. He zips around in them for work and fun. You know what else he's got? A killer watch collection worth more than a million bucks. We're talking fancy brands like Prim, Rolex, Patek Philippe, and Audemars Piguet. This guy's got style. And hold on to your seats because he's got a car collection that is off the charts. Think about all the coolest car brands you know. Ferrari, Lamborghini, Bugatti, Aston Martin, and Rolls Royce. Yep, he's got those in his garage. Plus, there's this mega armored limo he owns. Bullets and bombs? No biggie. It can handle them. Oh, and his adventures? Mikkel is like a real-life James Bond. He races in fancy car events, jets around the globe in his private jet, and chills in his mansion in Prague. This place is like a mini palace with a pool, a sauna, a cinema, and even a wine cellar. And guess what? He's got a legit castle too from the 13th century. He fixed it up so it has all the modern comforts. But wait, there's more. This dude's got a yacht, and he sails in it in the sparkling waters of the Mediterranean Sea. He's been all over the map, from Dubai to Monaco, the Maldives, Thailand, and who knows where else. It's like he's on a never-ending vacation. Next up is the Norwegian billionaire Gustav Magna Vitsoi. He's only 30, but he's already a billionaire. Gustav Magnar got a huge check of a company called Salmar ASA, which is all about farming salmon when he was just 19. Imagine that, a fishy fortune. Now he's one of the youngest billionaires on the planet. Talk about hitting the jackpot, right? With a present net worth of $3.1 billion. Gustav doesn't mess around when it comes to living it up. He's all about fast cars, fancy trips, and parties that probably make Hollywood jealous. But it's not just fun and games, he's also into fashion and modeling. Yep, he's got the looks and the style. He's even signed up with a Norwegian modeling agency. This guy's got the whole package. But hold on, Gustav isn't just living off the family fortune. He's a true entrepreneur. He's invested in cool stuff like real estate and technology startups. So he's not just a lucky heir, he's also a hardworking dude who's making his own mark. He has a mansion that's worth millions in Trondheim, Norway. It's got everything you'd want, a garden, a pool, a tennis court, and a garage full of cars that would make anyone drool. But that's not all. He's got a penthouse in Oslo that's like a million dollar dream, a killer view, a rooftop terrace, and even a jacuzzi. Talk about living large. And oh boy, he's got a yacht named Salmar, which is worth like $20 million. This yacht is like a floating paradise. It's got a helipad, a spa, a cinema, and even a gym. But that's not enough for Gustav. He's got a private jet called Salmar One. This thing is worth $50 million, and it's basically a flying palace. There's a bar, a lounge, and even a bedroom. It's like he's taken the coolest parts of being a billionaire and turned them into reality. If you're enjoying this video, why not hit that subscribe button? Next up is 21-year-old Luca Del Vecchio. This young man's got a mind-blowing $4 billion net worth, and he's not even old enough to rent a car in some places. Now here's the deal. Luca got his slice of the cake from his dad's fancy sounding company called Delphin. It's based in Luxembourg, and when his dad passed away, Luca got a sweet 12.5% piece of the company. Alongside his stepmother and six siblings, they're like a billionaire team. And Delphin isn't just about one thing. They own bits and pieces of big shots like Essilor Luxottica, Generali, and Insurer, banks like Mediobanca and Unicredit, and even a real estate developer called Covivio. It's like they're playing Monopoly in the real world. Now, even though Luca's loaded, he's not exactly parading around with golden helicopters or diamond shoes. Nope, he's keeping it low-key. He's got a swanky apartment in Milan, Italy, one of the fanciest cities in Europe. Also, this guy's got wings to go wherever he wants, whenever he wants. 
His dad got a Bombardier Global 6000, which is like the Lamborghini of planes, and Luca might have snagged a similar ride. You know, for those spontaneous trips around the world. Oh, and his art collection? His dad was all about that artsy life and gathered up paintings by the likes of Picasso, Modigliani, and Matisse. Now, Luca might have inherited some of that art stash, or he could have mixed in his own taste and added some new masterpieces. Next up is 19-year-old Clemente Del Vecchio. With a net worth of $4 billion, the 19-year-old sensation is not your typical billionaire. This guy might be the youngest billionaire on the block, but you won't catch him flashing his cash like a show-off. Clemente's just hanging out in Milan, Italy, keeping things real. He's a college student, all about that business administration stuff. No fancy jet setting or mansion parties for him. Nope, he's all about the chill life. Unlike his older siblings who are into the whole luxury scene, Clemente's doing his own thing. He's not into yachts, jets, or mansions. Nope, he's all about giving back. He's putting his money where his heart is, supporting education and health causes in Africa and Asia. This guy's a superhero in disguise. And guess what? He's got this artsy side too. Clemente's all about culture and creativity. He's got this collection of art by modern day geniuses. It's like he's creating his own personal gallery. He also goes around with his special watch, a Rolex Daytona Rainbow, which is like the king of bling. It's got a white gold case and bracelet, and the bezel is studded with 36 sapphires in all the colors of the rainbow. It's not just a watch, it's like a work of art on his wrist. And it costs a pretty penny, around $300,000 to be exact. Now, here's the cherry on top. Clemente's not just rich, he's also super cool. People say he's down to earth, generous, and humble. So even with all that cash, he's not letting it change who he is. He's like that buddy you can hang out with and forget he's a billionaire. Enjoying the video? Don't wait, hit that subscribe button and let the fun begin. Finally, we have Mark Mataschitz, the 31-year-old wonder with a jaw-dropping net worth of $40.2 billion. This guy's not just rich, he's rich in ways that'll make your head spin. Mark's dad, Dietrich Mataschitz, was the genius behind Red Bull, the mega energy drink company that's practically everywhere. Mark got some major genes from his dad and inherited a sweet 49% slice of Red Bull after he passed away in 2022. Now, this isn't just about the money. Mark's no slacker. He's all about Red Bull. He stepped down from being the head of organics and put his focus on being a major shareholder. Yep, he's got his eyes on the energy drink throne. But hold on to your hats, because Mark's got his hands in all sorts of luxury. He's got his own private island in Fiji, and it's not just any island. It's like a paradise playground with a luxury resort, a golf course, a spa, and even a submarine. He is also into vintage planes. He's got a whole collection, including planes like a Douglas DC-6B, a North American B-25 Mitchell, a Chance Vought F4U Corsair, and even a Lockheed P-38 Lightning. He's got them parked at his Hangar 7 complex in Salzburg, which is like an airplane wonderland with a restaurant, a bar, and even a museum. But wait, there's more. Mark's not just into planes, he's also a speed demon. He's got stakes in Formula One teams like Red Bull Racing and AlphaTauri. They've won a ton of championships and races, and he's got his own racing circuit called the Red Bull Ring. It's in Austria, and it even hosts the Austrian Grand Prix. Talk about taking speed to a whole new level. And it doesn't stop there. Mark has a thing for soccer. He's got his fingers in the pie with clubs like FC Red Bull Salzburg in Austria, RB Leipzig in Germany, the New York Red Bulls in the US, and the Red Bull Brazil in Brazil. But it's not just soccer. He's all about supporting different sports like ice hockey, basketball, cliff diving, and extreme sports. He's basically a sports mogul. If you want to stay entertained, click on one of the cards on the screen to explore more exciting videos. And make sure you don't miss out by hitting that subscribe button.